Hello and welcome to the Royal News Summary on the recent news that King Charles has reportedly agreed to his 62-year-old brother pursuing low-profile business interests. According to a source who spoke to The Sun, Prince Andrew is said to be less bothered than people think about losing his titles and official royal roles. He is more interested in forging a new career and has been keeping a close eye on what Harry and Meghan have been doing in America. While some reports suggest that Prince Andrew is not going to have a ceremonial role at King Charles's coronation because he's not a working member of the royal family, the decision has not been officially announced yet. The coronation will take place on May 6 at Westminster Abbey in London and will be followed by two days of celebrations, including a star-studded concert at Windsor Castle. The day itself will feature processions to and from Buckingham Palace, the Solomon Religious Coronation Ceremony, as well as an appearance on the palace balcony by Charles, Queen Camilla, and other members of the royal family. With only a few months to go until the bank holiday weekend, King Charles is said to be deciding on the role Andrew may or may not play. Some sources suggest that Andrew feels it would be inappropriate for his brother to be in an official position. Reports suggest that Prince Andrew is more focused on businesses and charities than anything on Netflix, as he is said to be interested in forging a new career. He has been seen attending various events and supporting charities since stepping back from his royal duties. While Prince Andrew may not have an official role at the coronation, he is still a Knight of the Garter, which traditionally performs significant roles during coronation ceremonies. When the late Queen was crowned in 1953, four Knights of the Garter were chosen to support Her Majesty by standing at the four corners of the coronation chair during the anointing. The four who are expected to do the job on Charles's big day have not been announced yet. It is worth noting that Prince Andrew was not present during the Garter Day procession last June, which may indicate his desire to take a low-profile role in official royal events. The decision on Prince Andrew's role at the coronation will likely be made by King Charles in the coming weeks, and we will keep you updated on any further developments. It is important to note that Prince Andrew has faced controversy and criticism in recent years due to his association with convicted sex offender Jeffrey Epstein. The prince has denied any wrongdoing and has faced calls to cooperate with U.S. authorities investigating the Epstein case. Despite the controversy, Prince Andrew has continued to carry out some official duties and has been seen attending events with other members of the royal family. While the decision on his role at the coronation may be a disappointment for some, it is clear that Prince Andrew is focused on building a new career and supporting charitable causes. It will be interesting to see what the future holds for Prince Andrew and how he will continue to navigate his relationship with the royal family in the years to come. Thank you for joining us on the recent news about Prince Andrew and King Charles's coronation. We will keep you updated on any further developments, so be sure to subscribe and hit the notification bell to stay informed.